So now it's time to unpack the backpacks. And maybe next weekend we'll get these out again and do a one-nighter. <clears throat> the big 30-mile trip is off the books. Downsize the backpacks. We are day hiking Ricketts Glen, right? Yeah. Right. Later. We are at Ricketts Glen hiking our way up to see the 17, maybe 19 waterfalls. It's going to be about a three and a half mile loop. Ready for fun. All right. Let's roll. Just leaving the road. Already one waterfall. One. One waterfall. Is that two? Two. Two waterfalls. How we go? You are here. The north. We're going to hang a left at Canoga. Canoga. Take the Highland Trail across. Drop back down. I'm thinking it's that A word. Awesome. Apparently people try to hike in flip-flops here. It's kind of exciting. Hmm. No flip-flops. I'm using the one guaranteed set of hiking boots I got. Yeah. They're gonna work just fine. All right. Let's go. Kitchen Creek. Is that what that is? Once the waters meet, they become Kitchen Creek. Sweet. Registered National Natural Landmark. That's cool. 1968, right? I think so. Okay, while we're walking, a real quick peek of what BD or CW, Coyote Whisperers, is using. Taking our hiking sticks. Turn, REI day pack, life's good. And I've got the same kind of pack. And carry the camera, which is a Sony letters and numbers, <laughs> not specific, less than 200 bucks. Uh, it has steady cam, so it's gonna make life easier as far as watching videos. Anyway, to carry, the camera and have it handy. He bought a Merce. It's not a Merce. It's, it's a Merce. It's a... It's a sling bag baby carrier Merce. It's a bandolier. Ah, oh, it's a bandolier. See, bandolier. Yeah. Merce. Merce. I am a Merce. You are a Merce. So we've been like on the trail now here for like 20 minutes. And yeah, there's no waterfalls here. So, I think it's a joke, eh? No waterfalls on this waterfall trail. What's that all about there, eh? Actually, we have to go in about a mile before we start hitting the awesome. This part of the trail is just awesome to walk. Gets us ready, gets our minds set, fired up. For the waterfalls. Ooh. about 300 yards back we have fork in the trail there's an upper portion that is moderate we took the difficult the difficult part just staying streamside until the trails meet back together at the first waterfall so they say I don't think there's waterfalls in this valley here eh no way we shall see Hey, 
Hey, there's still no waterfalls over there, eh? So, it's going great as far as how's it going. But there's no falls. I think maybe we took a left turn, eh? So what's the name of this waterfall? A look. Very first one. Murray Reynolds. How many feet? 16 feet. Okay. It's one of the smaller ones in height. Sheldon Reynolds waterfall. Woot to the woot. Nice. What's the name of the next one? Yep. Name of the next one is Yep.
look ahead. Oh, wow. One is this. Oneida. Or Oneida, depending on how you pronounce it. That's left. And then the Mohawk is at the very top. 